Do you need to take a screenshot on your iPhone, but your buttons aren't working? I'm going to show you two different ways on how you can take a screenshot on your iPhone without using any buttons. It's really easy to do so, and let's start right away. Firstly, we'll take a screenshot by using the Assistive Touch option on our iPhone. We can enable Assistive Touch by opening the settings on our iPhone, then open the Accessibility section. We will then click on the Touch option that's right under the Physical and Motor section. You will see the Assistive Touch option at the very top of this page, so we will click on it to open it, and then click on this switch right here in order to enable the option. This is going to show us a little virtual home button over our iPhone screen, and this is pretty useful if your iPhone buttons aren't working, because we can do a bunch of stuff with this. We will tap on this button, and you will get this little menu. In order to take a screenshot, you want to tap on the Device option, and then click on the More option. You're going to see the Screenshot button, so you can tap on it if you want to take a screenshot without using any buttons on your iPhone. But the catch is that this virtual home button will be shown in every app that you use on your iPhone, which can be distracting. So we will use another little trick in order to take a screenshot without this assistive touch option. The second method that we will use is to open the settings on our device, then go to the accessibility one more time. Go to the touch section once again, and when you get here, you want to scroll a little bit down to the bottom of the page until you can see the back tap option. This is a useful little feature on our iPhones that allow us to perform an action by using a double or triple tap on our iPhone's back. For example, I'm going to select the triple tap option and I have to select the screenshot from this list. Now, every time I want to take a screenshot on my iPhone, I have to tap three times on the back and the phone will take a screenshot without any buttons. You can set this for the double tap if it's easier for you, but that's essentially it. This is the best way that we can take a screenshot on our iPhone without using the physical buttons. Just use the back tap feature and enjoy. If you want more similar iPhone tutorial videos like this one, make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video.